Okay, you all. Come on in, y'all. Okay, so I'm going to let a few of you all come in first, okay? And then I'm going to get down to business, all right? But before I get down to business, before you do anything, be sure to follow me on Y Be Limited. That's the letter Y, the letter B, the word limited, official. Okay, so it's Y Be Limited official on Instagram. It's Y Be Limited on Facebook and on YouTube. Okay, so you'll be able to catch more videos like this. Um, my videos are going to be very, um, you know, like a wide range of stuff, but all kind of go around what I do. Uh, which is beauty, fashion, as, as well as like a bunch of like positivity, motivational, all of that stuff. But today, and, and also make sure you do a watch party with this and share this with your friends because today I will be doing a live demonstration of my skincare, okay? That's YBO skincare. It is all natural, it is organic, and it is um, formulated manufactured and distributed by Ryan Lemon. Okay, so all the formulas came from myself and my good, good friend Ruby Osby. We've been friends for like going on 30 years now. It's crazy. All right, so with that being said, um, I want you all to check in. Let me know where you're checking in from. Okay, what city, what state, what country. And from there, I'm going to go all into it. Okay, so right now, I'm starting with no makeup on. Okay, of course, because... You know, that's how you're supposed to start when you're doing a facial. So this is meant to be done once a week, okay? Um, because if you wear makeup, if you don't wear makeup, you definitely want to get what's in those pores out, okay? So even if you don't wear makeup, there's pollution, there's dead skin, there's all kind of stuff. Dead skin cells all up in the skin, okay? So you want to get that stuff up out your skin. You want to get up out your pores, okay? So the best way to do that is with a good skincare system. So, like I said, I'm going to do it live here. I'm going to start with our lavender citrus scrub, okay? Um, like I said, I make this stuff myself, myself and Ruby Olsby. So I whipped up this stuff here in the house. Um, and the lavender citrus scrub, like I said, is all natural, organic. And it has a natural cleaning agent in it as well, so you don't have to clean your face before you do the scrub, okay? So I'm going to go right on in and, you know, get some some water on my face, you know, a little bit of, little bit of hydration on my face, okay? I'm going to just put a little bit on there so that the, the scrub can um, spread easily, okay? So I'm going to put a little bit of the scrub in my hand and... I'm going to put it on my face. Like I said, it has a cleaning agent in it already. So I don't have to clean my face prior to doing this scrub. And what this scrub is going to do, it's going to take off dead skin cells, okay? It's going to pretty much leave you with like a fresh new layer of skin that you ain't met yet. So like after you take, you know, you know, after you do this, you're going to get a whole nother new layer of skin that you don't know. So you have to reintroduce yourself, okay? And it's almost like polishing your skin. Have you ever like done your own nails where you uh, foul your nails and then you buff them? And you know how when you're done buffing them, you have that shine and that sheen? Well, it's going to kind of start that process. The mask that you do after this is going to uh, reinforce that and do some other things as well. But we'll get to that in a second. So, um, I'm putting a little bit more water on my hands so that... and I. It's smoothly going around my skin, okay? Now, check that out, all right? I'm doing it in circular motions because I want that dead skin that's been stacking up. I need it gone, okay? We no longer need you. Your services have been, you know, gone, going that way, right? So, no, you no longer need it, okay? So, do that. And if you don't know, because a lot of people are like, oh, I don't wear makeup. I don't need to do no facial. Lies. Let them know I said it. Lies. Okay? Because no matter if you wear it or not, there's going to be dead skin cells piling up, like, all up on your skin. And you need to get up off of there. Okay? Nobody want that. Nobody got time for that. You know? At least I don't. If you do, 
than the dark beauty. I don't got time for that. I got to get it up out of there. All right. So I'm about to. And notice that I I, I um stay from around around my eyes. You're gonna pretend like you're wearing a pair of goggles. And wherever you have goggles on on your eyes, stay away from that because your eyes are the most sensitive part of your skin. Especially on your face or on your body, period. Okay? So, I'm just taking my water and my washcloth and I am washing this off. Okay? This is the first step. And the lavender citrus scrub has essential oils in it. So it has like that natural smell of lavender and citrus, but it also serves a purpose. Okay. And if anyone has any questions, be sure to put it in the comment section. I'm definitely willing to answer them for you. You all see that new layer of skin? See, I'm gonna have to reintroduce myself. Hello, new layer of skin. It's your friend Lily. Yeah, you belong to me. All right, so that's how you do it. You just gotta reintroduce yourself. Right, Cause you don't know this this layer. You ain't seen this layer yet. Okay, you had to go down there and get it. But this was the first step. You want to come behind a scrub with a good mask. Okay. I mean that's what we're gonna do next. So I got this all. Okay. I'm gonna push that pail of water to the side because I'm gonna use a fresh pail of water after I rinse off the mask because I don't need y'all coming for me okay call me all kind of dirty you know oh she reused the water from her you know I don't need that okay uh Sean I got you I got you okay I got your skincare set coming all right so this is I should have showed you the the scrub. This is the scrub. You probably can't see it really good in there. I put just a little bit in there because I just made some up for me today. And the mask, I actually made up some because Sean, you're going to get some. So that's why it's a bunch in there. Okay? Leave out the explicitives, please. Let me add those. All right. And I'm just going to put the mask on damp skin. All right. All right. There we go. It's all whipped up. Feeling all good. Smelling all good. Smelling all natural. Mm. How about that? This stuff feels good too. Now I'm gonna be honest with you. This charcoal mask is no joke. Okay, I'm gonna describe to you the experience as I'm going through the experience. Okay, and I made this mask so that it could be super functional. Like it's not just something cute, you know. Well, it ain't that cute when you got it on, but you know what I'm saying. Like, it ain't something to just sound good. Like, this thing is actually very powerful, and it works. The reviews, if you look at the reviews, you will see that the reviews are awesome because you will be surprised that this, is, that this is all natural and organic for how good it works because it's going to be like an exorcism for your face, you know? That's what it's like. It's going to go on there and get all that stuff that don't belong in there and say, look, you got to go. You evicted. Okay, we no longer need you here. All right? So that's what this is going to do. So when you put it on, it's going to be really creamy, very whipped, all right? Again, make sure you pretend like you have goggles on and stay away from that section of your eye. You do not want anything on there unless it's eye cream, pretty much. All right? So I'm doing that. Now... Uh, gentlemen and ladies, because I have a lot of bald ladies over here as well, for the sake of time, I did not put the mask and the scrub in my head. But on when I usually do this once a week, you can do this twice a week as well. I do put the scrub, I use the scrub on my head, and I use the mask on my head, okay? And that keeps down the bumps and everything like that. Actually, it eliminates them, all right? So... <laughs> That's an inside joke. I'm not even gonna repeat what he just said. So, um, yeah, you can make sure if you have a bald head to go ahead and put that in your head as well. Now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna start feeling this dry up. So you see the color changing. This is where it's starting to dry up. 
this is when it gets serious, okay? See, this is when you stop feeling like you've been, like you overdosed on Botox, all right? This is when you won't feel like um, Miss Nancy Pelosi, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you won't feel like the new Jada Pickett. You, 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 you get what I'm saying? Like you really ain't gonna be able to move your face, you know? So this is the time where you could probably tell the best lie ever because you'll be able to keep a straight face for real. So as this drives, it's gonna get real tight and you're gonna really start to feel all of the, the, the components that's in it start to go in and evict that dirt and all that stuff out your, out your face that don't belong there because it don't belong there, you know? So we wanna get it up out of there, all right? So that's what we're doing right now. Now, I usually keep this on for about, well, you can keep it on for 10 minutes, right? Like, not keep, you can keep it on for 10 minutes. You keep it on for at least 10 minutes. You can keep it on as long as you want to after that, okay? So if you one of those people who want to just fall asleep with it and you don't mind a little charcoal on your on your sheets and on your pillowcase, it's okay, you can do that. I'm not judging. I ain't say nothing because I ain't in your bed anyway. I don't think. But, you know, you can do that. Um, it does wash off your sheets. So if you're one of those people who fall asleep with the mask on, actually, I think my best friend does, man. I think he likes to fall asleep with his mask on, so... Hey, do whatever you want. But I usually keep it on for about 10 minutes. I'm not gonna keep it on for a full 10 minutes today because I'm doing a live video for, some, for the sake of time. I'm going to allow it to dry for sure. And then I'm gonna wash it off so you can see that extra new layer skin. So I might have to reintroduce myself again. Cause seriously, like when you do this, it's like polishing your skin for real, all right? Um, it's gonna take away that dullness. It's gonna give you that glow back. I swear by this, like I said, I've been doing this for a long time. And um, the other thing I like about it is the following day, or even if I decide to put on makeup the same day, which I usually don't, because I like my, my you know, face to breathe. But the following day, if I decide to wear makeup, like my makeup goes on like butter, like it looks airbrushed. Like I, I be walking around here and look like a Snapchat filter, all right? And that's the goal anyway, you know? So. You know, the pores are gone. Oh, the other thing about this, uh, it is good for all skin types, okay? Prior to releasing this line, I did a um, test group with, with over 200 people, okay? And because I'm a makeup artist, but I'm a skincare snob first, I did test groups for this so that I can make sure that it was good for all skin types. And what that means is if you have super sensitive skin, because I have clients who are like sensitive to everything next to water, okay? So if you're one of those people, you good. Because I tried it on people who have super sensitive skin that can barely use any products out there, all right? If you have dry, normal, combination, oily, all of those, you cover it. You cover it, okay? I got you. All right, because um, I couldn't be releasing something in my name and folks coming back all broken out and stuff. We can't be doing that. We can't be having that. So I did test groups, okay, and you know the results came. And actually, after doing the test groups, I had to reformulate it several times before it got to the place of exactly where I wanted it. So we were able to do that. All right, um, I'm very proud of that. The other thing is. Um, you know, we are revamping the line, so we're going to be adding three new products to the line by the summertime. I know a lot of you all are asking for the setting spray that I use when I'm doing my makeup. That is um, very, very essential to doing makeup, especially in the summertime. You know, a lot of people complain about their makeup, you know, sliding off and all this stuff. I, I, mm -mm, mm -mm. No, we don't do that. No sliding off. If I put you, mm, sorry, if I put you on makeup, I need you to be there when I look back in the mirror. Okay, hours from now. I need you there, makeup. Okay, be with me. Be my friend. You know, that's what I need. So, for sure, that will be coming out. Um, a body lotion as well, because I have been making my own body lotions for a long time as well, because, you know, I'm all about that smooth, glowy, glowy skin. You know, I want that God from within skin. You know, that's what I'm looking for when I, you know, for my, out of my skin. So, yeah. 
I see. Hey, Angie McCoy, how are you? I'm glad you're on here. So you see it's starting to change colors, okay? It is dry, it is hardened up. It's not going anywhere. And it's not here to play with you or me, all right? This mask is here to stay, you know? I wish I had my bangs, so I wanted to dry quicker. So let's get some more air on this thing, okay? Because I want this thing to dry so I can wipe it off and I can show you what's underneath. Oh, yeah. see that is helping. Yeah. Oh, and I just redid my nails last night, so I hope you all like them. I actually figured out how to make my own acrylic. I've been working on that for a while, so I've actually been making my own acrylic for my nails. And it's been lasting. It works too, so because I did it last week and it lasted until this week. Well, it actually would have lasted longer than that. I just tired of looking at the same, you know, nail design, so I'd be ready to do it over again. But yeah, so this is the new design that I did last night, and I'm loving it. So maybe one day I'll do a video showing you how I do my own nails with my own homemade acrylic. I think that'd be fun, you know. Uh, Ooh. And like I said in a previous video, I've been making my own skincare products, my own products since I was a kid. This comes natural to me. This is something I absolutely love. Before being a makeup artist, I am a skincare enthusiast, snob, expert, all of the above first. You know, it is not about the makeup. It is about the skin underneath the makeup. You have to take care of that skin, you know, because all of us are going to age. All of us, I don't care how much melan melanin you got, you know, I don't care how much or what, we're all going to age, but none of us are in a rush to do it. So to keep that process, you know, down, the best way to do it is to take care of your skin. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. All right. Now, I'm going to switch out the water, and I'm switching out my cloth as well all right and i'm not using i'm using a different cloth from when i did the scrub all right and i'm about to go in and wash this off how about that all right and this comes off pretty easy um Usually I'm in the shower when I do this, but I want to do it live so you can see that there's no trickery, bakery, or phonery going on, you know, live, up close. See? Easy, right? Simple, very gentle on your skin, but not gentle on the stuff that's supposed to come up out of your skin. No, it's harsh on that, okay? Mmm, look at that. Right? Mm-hmm, it cures the pores. Because I have super oily skin, but this is balanced for oily, dry, normal, or combination of skin. So I'm really proud to be able to say that. Okay. You can use it all year round. Look at my dark circles on fleek, honey. How about that? Alright. Look at that. Wow. Got a little bit right here. I'm gonna let that you gotta go. Alright. Alright. So it's coming off smooth, you know? You all seeing that? Hey, Tonia. Tonia's on here. She has tried the line. Her and her, I think her daughter has. Have you, have you tried the line, Tonia, or my line? You probably meant to try the line. I know some of you will try it. Let's see. Mm-hmm. Look at that, y'all. Mm-hmm. 
I'm gonna let it sweep around just to make sure it's all gone. All right. Now, now that you got that, oh yeah, you did try when you was in New York. Okay. So now that that's all, right? What you wanna do is pat your face dry. Now, a lot of times when you're dealing with a mask like this, that is, you know, somewhat of an exorcism of your skin, it is taking all of the bad stuff out and some of the good stuff in, but it is formulated to put some good stuff back in. So what I usually do is I use, well, actually, let me, let me skip. This is not one of my products. Because I shave every day on my face, and my head, I usually use a product for um, shaving. It's not one of my products, so I do not want to promote them because they ain't gave me a coin, all right? And until they give me a coin, I ain't talking about it. I'm gonna keep it to myself, all right? Now, the next product we have is the Vitamin C Serum. And I put it in a different bottle because everything is over in China right now and, you know, the manufacturer, because that's the only thing that comes from an outsource is our packaging. Everything else is coming from us. So I put the vitamin C serum on, right? So make sure I put all the good stuff in. Moisture, it evens out my skin tone. Make sure I maintain the texture. Okay. Okay. Very important. Okay. Now, that that's done, you want to moisturize. Always want to moisturize. So the moisturizer I use is not going to be the moisturizer that you use, but we're going to be adding um, a new moisturizer to the line at some point. I'm not sure if it's going to be for this upcoming launch because I still haven't sent it out to the test group yet. Um, so that's very important. I have to test it out first before we add anything to the line. So if we can get it tested before our launch, then it will be on this next lunch, okay? And then after that, after you moisturize, what you want to do is, especially if you are 25 and older, and most of my followers are, you always want to follow that up or end this, this whole process off with an eye cream, okay? That's what you want to do. And the eye cream is going to keep you from having like them really bad dark circles and keep from creasing and put some moisture around your eyes. You know, it just helps to have that, that youthfulness to your eyes because eyes age first and worse. I don't care who you are. That's going to be the first signs of aging and that's going to be the worst signs of aging is doing that through those eyes. So if you start early and do preventative measures, it really helps to keep all of that down. If you already have signs of aging, that's okay because this will definitely help with that. You'll see a huge difference. Uh, it does well wear well underneath your makeup as well. So that's a plus, you know, especially for someone like me who loves to wear makeup. We don't want uh, eye cream that doesn't wear well underneath your makeup. Now with eye cream, you want to put that on twice a day, okay? Eye cream is twice a day. The vitamin C serum can be used every night, okay? Especially if you have dry skin. If you have combination skin, you want to use that in the um, spots that are dry, not in the spots that are oily. Tonya says, yes, Jazzy skin has dark spots since she got pregnant. Okay, so that's what the vitamin C serum will help. Actually, this whole line, but the vitamin C serum will help if you do that every day, okay? And if you do the scrub and the mask twice a week, why is my cat, girl, Miss TT is always trying to make an appearance. Could you stop it, Miss Girl? Miss Thing. Thank you. All right, so, and the dryness, yes, the vitamin C serum will help with that as well. Okay? So, if you have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comment section. I'll be sure to answer them. 
And make sure you do a watch party, share this with your friends, and follow me on social media at YB Limited. Okay, that's the letter Y, the letter B, the word limited. It's YB Limited official on IG, which is Instagram, and it's YB Limited, just straight up YB Limited on Facebook and on YouTube. So I have a lot of videos on YouTube. I'm adding more. I have nothing but time right now, so I'm going to be doing a lot of different things, a lot of content, so it's not going to all be makeup based, it's not going to all be fashion based, it's going to be pretty well rounded for people of all walks of life, okay, because I like to be all inclusive. So until next time, always remember to ask yourself, why?